President Umningagwa has clarified the appointment of General Philip Valerio Sabanda to the ZANU-PF Politburo, stating that it is a legitimate decision. The president emphasized that Jen Sabanda, who will serve as an ex officio member, is not a civil servant and will not have voting rights within the Politburo. Speaking to journalists at the Saudi Arabia Africa Summit, President Umningagwa explained that an ex officio member is allowed to contribute but cannot vote. People are mistaken. They think that General Sabanda is a civil servant. He is not, said President Umningagwa. Secondly, he is an ex officio member of the Politburo, which means he is not a substantive member of the Politburo. He cannot vote. He is an ex officio. There is no contradiction, and I as president can appoint anyone as ex officio member, which means by virtue of a particular position, you can be allowed in a certain board. I don't know who gets offended. He Jen Sabanda cannot vote but he can contribute because he is ex officio member. The appointment of Jen Sabanda aligns with the ruling party's tradition of including military wings in top decision-making bodies. Dating back to the pre-independence era, the president made the announcement during the ZANU-PF annual National People's Conference and stated that it was in accordance with the party's constitution. Top military personnel in the country who invariably were products of the ruling party ZANU-PF, were also appointed to the Politburo at one point or the other during their professional lives. Analysts have also said that every Zimbabwean has the right to make political choices, regardless of their employment status or position in society.